Welcome to Superhero Pow. I'm your host nerd, Tom Frumgen. Today I wanted to talk about one of my favorite superheroines, Wonder Woman. And did I mention she's the only major superhero to never get her own cartoon show? Just what the hell's up with that? Anyway, I wanted to talk about one of the biggest misconceptions of the character, her wardrobe. Yes, I cover all the important topics of the day. You see, for a few decades now, everyone assumed Wonder Woman debuted in 1941 wearing a skirt. So much so that recent costume designs have tried to harken back into those days by putting her in a tacit belt. You know, one of these things? She was wearing them in the movies? But here's the thing. Wonder Woman never wore a skirt. She wore a cloette skirt. Or skort. Or you can call them wide mouth shorts or bell bottom shorts for all I care. The main point is, she never wore a skirt. You see, the trick is, it looks like a skirt when your legs are together. That sounded weird. Did that sound weird? That sounded weird. But as you can see from the original comics, there are actually two leg holes in her star-spangled clothing. So, skort, not skirt. Why? Well, around the time Wonder Woman was created, it was fairly common for female athletes to wear a skort or cloette shorts. To be honest, the history of women's active wear is just crazy. Because heaven forbid a woman dresses like a man. Heck, it's even mentioned in the Bible that God frowns on that. So a woman must always dress feminine, but not sexy. All this nonsense even goes on today as some people try to tell female tennis players, volleyball players, and track and field athletes what they can and cannot wear. But back in the 1930s, the cloette allowed women to play sports and still look ladylike. While we're on this crazy aside, it's interesting to note that famed Wonder Woman actress Linda Carter actually made her own costume smaller. In season one, she was wearing a pair of bulky shorts, which cut into her... <clears throat> upper thigh as she ran around. So when they rebooted the series in season two, she asked that the new costume have scalloped leg holes. Getting back to the comic books, original artist Harry G. Peter apparently wasn't a fan of the skort look and he quickly changed them to just shorts. Then in issue nine of Sensation Comics, her pants transformed into long bicycle shorts, which were more form-fitting. Oddly enough, women back then often just wore shorts when bicycling, and it was the men who would wear the long bicycle shorts when racing. Again, many contemporaries assumed Wonder Woman was wearing long swimming shorts, but that was really just a minor style from the 1920s, so I don't think Peters was trying to bring back a minor style from the 1920s in 1942. The bicycle shorts lasted until about 1948, when in Sensation Comics number 83, they were turned into just tight shorts. The actual length varied depending on the artist and the pose, but they were no longer mid-thigh in length. Her look changed again in 1968 with the infamous Deep Power mod redesign, and then in 1973 when she was repowered and given the modern bathing suit look that most people are familiar with. Getting back to this skirt idea, so when did Wonder Woman first wear a skirt? Well, when George Prez rebooted her in 1987, he gave Wonder Woman a downtime outfit of the traditional design, with the first star-spangled skirt Wonder Woman ever wore in issue number seven. I should also point out it was in issue number one where Wonder Woman wore her very first tacit belt, as part of her decked-out battle armor. On a side note, for a short time in the late 90s, Wonder Woman's mother, Queen Hippolyta, became Wonder Woman. This was because Wonder Woman died and became a god, and, well, anyway, she wore a skirt as her regular costume. DC would even rewrite things, saying Hippolyta was the Wonder Woman of the 1940s, hence the skirt. Which brings us up to today, where DC doesn't want Wonder Woman objectified in short shorts, so they put her in a tacit belt, supposedly honoring her original skirt days from the 1940s, which we all know now never happened. Because Wonder Woman has never worn a skirt. She has always worn some sort of pants, from clothes to panties. Because I assume she's wearing panties under that tacit belt, right? Right? Well, there's another G I didn't know that fact from me to you. And thanks so much for watching.
And if you could be so kind to subscribe, YouTube will reward me with a pat on the head. And who doesn't want one of those? <laughs>